Between Gainesville and McAnope, you drive through Payne's Prairie, but what is hidden beyond the highways that cut through this Florida natural wonder might surprise you. And this week's What's Growing on TV20 Scott Gagliardi tells us why you now might be the best chance to catch a glimpse of some of the wild horses that call the prairie home. What's Growing on, sponsored by Alachua County Farm Bureau, the voice of agriculture. Some of the wildlife at Payne's Prairie State Park have been residents long before America was even discovered. And as much as they may have overstayed their welcome, they're a part of what makes this preserve so unique. Payne's Prairie State Park, spanning over 21,000 acres, has been known for its diverse wildlife and unique ecological features. And the presence of wild horses has created a renewed sense of wonder and excitement among locals and tourists. These animals were once thought to be extinct in the area, but today, there are over 60 roaming thousands of acres and only add to the already picturesque landscape. They remain untouched by humans and are very self-reliant, but in colder months, it's a bit more difficult to find food. This time of year, however, they are foraging on the blooming dune meadows and salt marshes, lush with sea oats and cord grass. Since the wild horses are scavengers, they really have to find their food, especially in the winter. The horses are descendants of Spanish explorers from the 16th century who originally brought them here to herd cattle. They have thrived in the park's vast grasslands, wetlands, and oak hammocks. Today, they are known as cracker or tacky horses, and their presence not only adds to the park's beauty, but also offers an opportunity for researchers and conservationists to study their behavior and impact on the local ecosystem. They were even named the Florida Horse of the Year for their sustainability after nearly 400 years. Florida designated the Florida Tacky Horse back in 2008, and that is a direct reflect from the wild horses. In addition to these wild horses, you will find nearly 1,500 alligators, over 300 species of birds, as well as a small herd of bison. They were introduced here from Oklahoma in 1975, and today there are 50 to 70 that roam the prairie. The Florida State Park System and local authorities are working together to ensure the preservation and conservation of the wild horses and the other animals on the prairie in their own natural habitat. Payne's Prairie State Park's wild horses have not only captured the hearts of those who encounter them, but also serve as a reminder of the importance of preserving and protecting our natural heritage. As these majestic animals continue to roam the park freely, they symbolize the resilience and beauty of the untamed wilderness, creating an enduring connection between development and the nature in the heart of Florida. For more information on where to see these wild horses and for park hours, visit our website. That's WCJB.com. Reporting at Payne's Prairie Preserve State Park in Micanopy, Scott Gagliardi, TV 20 News. Love that park. Some amazing yeah. visuals right there. You don't get that kind of access every day. Still to come, one college student.